right, welcome back to the channel, everyone. It is your favorite champ, the heads up, 7up champ, also known as I'm Ghost Rogue. In today's video, I'm getting a much requested thing done. Just like a lot of you guys requested to do a tutorial, which I already had planned, but you know, knowing that more people want it, I'm gonna go ahead and attempt to do this. This is my very first tutorial ever, so bear with me. Um, so first things first, guys. You need to make sure that you have your own legal copy of Madden 12 and the PS2 BIOS. You know, in order to do that, you can rip it and stuff like that onto your PC. Um, but other than that, you know, we don't condone piracy or anything like that. So um, once you have all that, we are good to go. So there's going to be a few things that you guys are going to need to download once you guys have your ISO and everything like that in your BIOS. So the first thing what we're going to do is we're going to be going to, uh, well, first and foremost, all these links are gonna be down in the description below for you guys, okay? So if you guys have any questions, of course, we're gonna be in the Discord if you guys want to um, ask any questions and we'll do our best to help. Now, once that's said and done, you're gonna to go to the first link, which is gonna be the pcsx2.net slash downloads, and you're gonna to go to page 97. You're gonna to wanna to download the 1.7, any of the 1.7s actually would work. Um, we're gonna go ahead and go with this version here, okay? You're gonna go ahead and hit download. You're gonna hit download for Windows. And then once that's downloading, which mine's is done because I got fast internet, you're gonna wanna go to image burn. So you're gonna Google image burn. We're just gonna go to downloads. I'll have it for you guys. Um, you're gonna wanna click mirror seven provided by image burn, okay? I already have it downloaded, so I'm not gonna download it again. Um, but you know, it'll be the same process as what I'm gonna be doing right now. So you're gonna click your downloads. You're gonna go to your um, downloads folder here. Uh, downloads folder and you see it right here. I'm gonna drag mine out right there. Oh, it went to my life, by the way. Right there. Okay. Okay. So once it's downloaded, you're gonna right click. You're gonna use 7-zip. I recommend using 7-zip or, or RinRAR or any other extraction tool. You're gonna go to extract files. So I already made a file for my PC SX2. You can do that too by right clicking, go to new, hit folder, and then it'll pop this up and you can name it. So you're gonna do, hit these three dots here. You're gonna go to desktop. And then look for the PC SX2 folder that you made. Click that, hit okay, then okay. And then let it do its thing. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up this folder. You're gonna hit up the uh, PC SX2. Okay, you're gonna open it. Now you're gonna wanna unclick this, the enable automatic updates. You don't want that on because if you go any higher, this mod will either not work or not work properly, okay? And then you can select your language and then select whatever theme you want. So for this video, we're gonna go ahead and just do it, okay? So now it's looking for our bios. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to browse. So I'm in another folder too for my bios, okay? So we're gonna go to uh, desktop because that's where I have my bios and look for PS2 bios. Where are you right here? Select folder and there's my bios right there. Hit next. Hit yes. And then you're gonna wanna make another folder too for your games or for this mod. So I'm gonna, I already made the folder. There's no game in it yet. So what I'm gonna do is hit add back to my desktop and I'm gonna go to AMM, -M, A -M mod. Cause that's where I'm gonna put the uh, mod at. So it's there, it's selected, hit next. I have my DualShock automatic mapping for my um, PS4 uh, controller. So that's mapped already. That's the one I'm using. You could use Xbox or whichever other controller. You can hit next and finish. So we're done with it. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and close it because I noticed it usually gives me problems. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to settings. We're gonna make a memory card. Okay. You're gonna hit uh, memory card here. Eject these because you don't have anything. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit create. Now I use the folder because I edit the rosters and uh, help the team out with the rosters. And I found that the easiest, if you're not going to do that, you could go ahead and do a 64 um, megabit one. You're going to name that PS2 uh, mod, I guess. Oh, not that PS2 mod, you know, you can name it, whatever, and then hit. Okay. So that's been created. So you're going to insert that by draw dragging and dropping. So that's in there. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go to uh, graphics. We're going to go with the renderer. 
Now you can use Direct 11, 12, Vulcan. All of them work. A lot of people recommend Vulcan. So that's what we're going to do. And then we're going to select our graphics card here. Whether that be a 3090, 5090, 4090, whatever it is. And then for full screen, you're going to go to borderless. For an aspect ratio, you're going to go to fit uh, window slash full screen. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go to rendering. Unselect min mapping because that is going to cause a lot of problems. Okay. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to go to internal resolution. So I play at 4K. So if you play at 1080, you select 1080. But I am at four, uh, uh, 2K, actually, 1440. And then this is good to go. Now, this is important. Okay. This is very important. So for the textures to load properly, you're going to want to make sure you hit load textures and have asynchronous uh, texture loading on. Okay. And then what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to, in order for it to find these textures that we're going to be downloading, you're going to want to go to browse. You're going to go to documents. You're going to go to PC SX2. And then you're going to click the textures folder and hit select. Okay. So that's where we're going to install our textures. That's actually going to be the next step. So we're going to close this. And then just for sakes to make sure that the controller is actually selected, we're going to check. It looks like it is selected properly. Go to that. We're going to close it. Now what we're going to do is we're going to make another folder, which I already have. Again, if you guys don't know how, right click, new folder, and name it, whatever. This, we're going to use this for our ISO. So we're going to right click our ISO, our Madden 12 ISO, open with Windows Explorer. Okay. All this that you see in here, you're going to want to highlight it, right click, copy, open up that folder that we just made and paste it. Let it do its thing. So we're done with it. So we could eject the folder now. I mean, eject the uh, CD. Okay. So now what we're left with is the folder we just made. Now we can close this. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go to the next website, which is the another mod website. It's not a website. It's a Google Drive. Okay. So then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to ISO method. And then you're going to want to right click it and download. Sorry, I went too far. You're going to want to right click and hit download. Now this takes a while, guys. It could take, I, the most it's taking me was 15 minutes. Okay. Um, you know, just let it do its thing. Okay. So then once you have that, which I already have a download already, you're going to want to right click the folder, Let's drag it to the folder. right click the folder, hit your seven zip extract here. So let it do its thing. So that's done. So we can close it out, open up the folder we just made. So there's a new roster that's going to be coming out, guys. And I just finished it today. It's November 7th. I just gave it to Joshua Blackstone. And he's going to be releasing it on November 8th or 9th. Okay. So if you guys, you know, need the new roster, just let us know. We could send you the link. So what we're going to do. So since we just have week one right here, we're going to double click that. And you see these two folders. You're going to highlight, right click, copy. And then we're going to put it in that folder where we copied all of our ISO stuff at. Okay. Right click into this folder hit paste and then you're going to replace the files that are here so we're done now we're done with that so what we're going to do is now we're going to open up image burn the image burn that you just downloaded which mine's is right here you're going to open up image burn you're going to hit this middle one right here create image file from file slash folders you're going to uh, go to file explore, uh, explorer or browse for folder and now you're going to look for that aam which is right here we're going to select it. You're going to select its file for destination, which remember that other folder I told you that we made the AAM mod for the games. That's where we're going to put it. You're going to hit save in there. And then now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click this middle button here that says build. And then once it's done, you're going to hear this uh, jungle chime. You're going to hit yes. Yes. And okay. Mm, 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 mm. all done all right so now it's in here oh wait no that one where's my ammo right here this is the mod so we're done with that now what we could do is we can open up our pc sx2 make sure it's in there and it's there 
Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the site. We're going to go to texture downloads. And since we have the 1.7 version, you're going to want to do the PCSX2 1.7 textures. Okay, right click and download. Again, it's going to take a minute, guys. Then once that's done downloading, guys, remember, and remember, guys, all this stuff is going to be in your downloads folder. I just have mine on the desktop, okay? So then what you will do is you'll right click, extract files, extract here. I already have them out here, so but I'm just going to hit yes to all. Because I already had them. It, it's on my second screen. Give me one second. What you're gonna want to do is open it up. You see this folder right here? So we're gonna go back to our uh, file. We're gonna right click the files. We're gonna go to documents. Now we're gonna look for the PC SX2 folder, which is right here. You're gonna scroll down, open up the textures folder, and this folder that you see right here, you're gonna drag that bad boy in there. Boom. In. There's another thing I want you guys to check in your settings. So when you go to rendering, take your uh, anoscope or filtering and, and mess with that a little bit because it'll make it look a little clearer. Um, you could do off if you want it, 2, 4x, or 16. I'm going to do 16 because my PC is strong enough for that. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and check to see if this game works. I remember this guys it is, this is just the base mod with you know all the updated textures no updated field or uh any extra um uniforms so let's go ahead and make sure that this works go ahead and load this up everything looks good we're gonna have to lower down the music real quick so give me one second i'm gonna have to give you guys a cut all right so everything looks like it's working all you guys missed was me selecting a team which i hate the bears oh i'm a panthers fan so what we're going to do first is to check to see if the roster is loaded. Move my mouse out of the way. Looks like they did. So remember, guys, there is an updated roster that's going to be coming out on November 8th or 9th. Uh, with, this is after the trade deadline, so all the trades are going to be in there. Um, I had fixed all the body types, all the player gears. Um, so it's going to be, I think it's a fairly big update. I, I would say so. Look at that. You got all your players in here. You got your free agents. Oh, wait, that's not free agent. Right here, Blaine Gabber. All your free agents are here. Um, Caleb Williams, Joe Burrow. Yeah, you guys got all the players here, all right? So now, if you guys did install the um, extra expansion mod for the um, uniforms, you would see them here. You just press circle. I don't have it on this one because uh, I'd rather keep it like this. So you're not gonna have the all black. I mean, but it doesn't matter. So, and then let's go ahead and test the game. All right, looks like we're all loaded in. Look at this, look how crisp this looks, guys. My goodness gracious. Come on, man. Let me get the ball first. All right, let's do it. Oh, I missed the tackle. <laughs> Dude, I suck. All right, come on, let's go. Get the crowd pump. Oh my God, I missed that too. <laughs> Dude, I suck. <laughs> oh, he's injured already, first play of the game. What a loser. Oh man. All right, so it looks like everything works here, guys. You know, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you guys can, please make sure to leave a like, uh, subscribe if you guys can. I really do appreciate all the new subscribers that came through, man. I, I really, really appreciate it. And make sure to keep an eye out for my series that's going to be coming out soon. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.